uh, the first experience that I have um, is it took place in my bedroom or like a recreation of the bedroom here that I, that I stay in. And on the wall uh, that is above where the, my bed is, so above where I sleep, um, I have all these uh, post-it notes and I have all these papers and I have all these pictures. It's just kind of like a, a uh, collage or something like that or like a uh, bulletin board kind of for me so I can look at these things and different ideas. Um, and anyways, I have it all pinned up like that on my wall. And in this experience, I was standing up and I was looking at all these uh, things. I was looking at all these papers. And all of a sudden, the window to my left-hand side uh, got thrown open. Um, it's a sliding window, so I guess not thrown open, but it slid open and it, you know, opened very clearly. I could hear it. I didn't look at it, but uh, again, I could hear it. And when the window opened, this giant gust of wind came through. This giant gust of wind came through and it started wanting to take the papers off the wall. It was like throwing them because I have them pinned with thumbtacks. So some of them, it just totally ripped off the wall and other ones, it kind of like was shaking them around. You know, it was like a tornado was passing through my room uh, trying to take away all these papers and all these different things, like literally take away all these ideas about it. Um, that was the experience that I had. I can share a second one, but if anyone wants to comment on that. Uh, yeah, there's an old saying, Jeremy, the wind of change. So uh, just take a look, see what happens, uh, because there's always something new. So the idea is, is that, uh, you know, you're in the personal self, you already know all that. Okay. And in the physical, it's, it can be different many times, because again, we need physical things here uh, to play with and do. But on the real side, this is where things start and gradually uh, filter and transform into the physical. So, yes, an opening, uh, all of a sudden the window throws open, and it's like life is coming in, like the air we breathe. And uh, it's, uh, it's, okay, time for something new, you see? So, uh, it's up to you to also learn to see that. Yeah, and so, gone through it many times, and it's okay, it's, it's, it's good, because we, we go through that part of it, and then all of a sudden, uh, you know, it's swept away. But it's looking at the unknown. This is where you see and recognize uh, there's something else taking place. So it doesn't mean that it's just going to instantly show up. Certain things will. But again, you learn to see it and what else is taking place. So we're, we're focused on what we're doing, but there's always more to it. Uh, and there's uh, better ways to do it or whatever. So all of a sudden, see, you learn. It's just like when all those years I went through Ekencar. Now, uh, right now, I don't need it. I don't need none of it, okay? Uh, none of the stuff that's on the earth or creation. Don't need none of it. But at the same time, I needed to go through it to see, okay, and compare and see the difference. So that helps our awareness. That comparison helps us become more aware. So... That's what I see. It's a new moment, and it's like uh, the old stuff is being swept away because there's something new coming into the personal self for you. Yeah, go ahead. 